this is a research project that I have been working on for several semesters now and this research project uh, pertains to the concept of magnetic levitation. Uh, today we are going to try to attempt to levitate a certain object, in this case a uh, metal ball. And um, the concept of this is to position this ball at a certain point and uh, be able to control the current through this uh, coil. So let's go ahead and try to attempt that. So as you can see, the ball levitates uh, a certain distance from the coil, and that distance is pretty far. The reason why that distance is pretty far is because I am using a magnetic ball to increase the distance from the coil to the ball. Uh, this uh, system was hard to design. Everything was done from scratch. And there's an image of the actual circuit there. It's just a couple of op amps, resistors, and uh, voltage regulators too as well. There's some power supplies to be able to run the system. So as you can see the ball is still levitating at that point where I left it. So we're going to go ahead and grab it and try to levitate other objects. This system is very robust uh, and we can, it's because of that, that that we can levitate different objects at that same position. So right there we are levitating two balls so as you notice, it's still levitating there, and uh, there's some movement there, and we can, uh, and it'll still continue to levitate. But if we want to minimize the movement, there we go. Another ball with uh, another object mounted to it, and we can levitate it to as well in different positions. There we go see it's still levitating there. You could change the position of it on the ball and it will still stay. There we go. So you can see it's not touching the board and it's all to a different object and we can have it. Okay, thank you for watching.